Many came, but few were chosen. Ooh, another beautiful lineup. John Hurley and David Fry. Beverly Hills has gone to the dogs. All right, John, we're in Beverly Hills for this competition now, so this must be a star-studded event. Are there any celebs we will see on the red carpet? Maria Menounos will be hosting the uh, the trip down the red carpet, Ooh. and we have many, many, many showing up, and we also have them bringing their own dogs to sit there in the arena and watching the show as well so that they can be entertained, and it's wonderful to have them. You'll see uh, Bo Derek there, the beautiful Bo Derek, wow. and uh, that always sets my heart and jump every year to see her. <laughs> and uh, we have uh, quite a crew there. It's going to be a lot of fun. All right, I'm going to ask you both, who do you think is more high maintenance, the show dogs or the Hollywood starlets? Here's the thing is, you know, what... When it comes down to best in show and you pick, you've culled through the best of the dogs and you have seven left, the dogs don't really care. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee you, I guarantee you when you get down to your finalists on Miss America, they care. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Now, David, the show rolls out the red carpet for all the dogs, but I watch every year. Who is the favorite? We have three of the top five dogs in the country are going to be at, uh, in this Beverly Hills show. Uh, it could be anybody's dog show. There's a lot of great dogs there. Uh, whoever has that divine moment of inspiration at the right time when the judge is watching, then uh, that's the dog that's going to win. It's a dog show, and you got to show. you got to be a great specimen of your breed, but you better be a show dog as well. That's the, that's the joy of doing these these shows year on and uh, year in and year out uh, because there's always something new and you're always seeing a better better representation of the breed uh, and that's what keeps us coming back that's amazing i want to say this for john that through the our years together it's going to be 19 in the national dog show this is our fourth year at beverly hills um he's gotten a pretty good eye and he's mm. he's become much more than just another pretty face on television <laughs> uh in, in coming to the dog shows and he's he's able to pick out the winners i, I try to be a good representation of my breed <laughs> <laughs> you're also a good representation uh do you think right. both of you that best in show nailed it that goal is that best in show ribbon. Actually, oh. poodle means um, puddle in German. You want your busy bee? Come get your busy bee. Cut her with him. She doesn't get a door. She's going to flip out. We were concerned that they were going to make fun of the dogs. Uh, which they did not do. They didn't make fun of the sport. They only made fun of the people. And as I like to say, we are a target-rich environment in terms of the people that are involved in our sport. They're just like all your friends and neighbors doing other things as well. It's a great family sport, and we have all kinds of people there as well as all kinds of dogs. That's... And as G.K. Chesterton once said, the test of a good religion is how well it can take a joke. Oh, that's <laughs> great. I'm going to end on that because that we is perfect. The object of satire. It was great fun. <laughs> it was great. Christopher Guest and the, and the rest. Man, I watch that movie every year. John O'Hurley and David Fry. I can't tell you what a big fan I am. We own Cavaliers, Blenheims, in fact, back at home at my family. So oh. I'm a huge fan for you all. And I love the picture right behind you, David. Thank you again for stopping by.